Hey, what is up, guys? It's Luke from Luke's Rocky World here, and today I'm recording on my phone, so the audio might not be the best, but you know, we work with stuff like this. Um, today. I'm not going to be looking at the camera directly because it's really bright and it hurts my eyes. So, um, I'm just going to kind of explain this while not looking, but kind of looking at the same time. So, um, today the reason I'm outside and I'm vlogging, look at our beautiful yard. Um, yeah, it's pretty cool. Um, but the reason I'm vlogging today is because, um, as you guys know, it's, ha it's around Halloween and... I know I'm a little late on this, but I am recording this video because today, as you can see over there, that's one of our Halloween things. But we, me and my mom, are putting up our Halloween decorations. Um, so this one over here, his name is Freddy. Um, that was like me and my brother's name for him, I think. Um, we got him like uh, two years ago, and I made up a story about him. But I don't exactly remember what the story was. So, um, I'm just going to make one up. And then, yeah, I'll explain that later. So, watch to the end of this video so you can hear the amazing story about Freddy that I'm making up. And also, I got manly feet. So, I'm not wearing any shoes or anything. What are those? So... What are we going to do first, Mom? Well, the things are a little bit tangled. Yeah. So, so we need to untangle um, his anger. Technical difficulties. We'll be right back. Okay, well, I just wanted to say this. We're not done untangling it yet. Um, but I just wanted to say this um, about my manly feet. Like, really, what the heck are those? Earlier today... So, since it's getting a little cold outside, grass doesn't grow as well, like trees and stuff don't grow as well. Um, my mom put like rice or something that helps the, the grass outside because our grass was crap. And, um, what is it called? <laughs> Stuff filling. That's all I heard. My phone, not my phone, my remote control. It's my TV. I washed in the washing machine it was in my bed comforter i put my remote control to my tv in the washing machine with my comforter and when i realized i did it i stopped it but it got water damage so that's I, not what i'm talking about mom so i put it in rice and stuck it outside i put it in a tupperware thing of rice and stuck it outside to dry oh. the dogs ate the tupperware with the rice in it and got the rice all over the yeah, and then buggies come, stupid rice bugs. Um, I was walking out there, and I stepped in, like, these rocky thingies, but they weren't rocks. So I just kept walking, and all of a sudden, like, pinchies on my foot. And I'm like, oh, God, oh, oh, God, ah, ah. And I ran back inside, and I, like, smacked my feet a bunch of times. I swear, like, those things hurt it a lot. Like, they stung. So, um, then also, a little scary creepy thing these lights they keep turning on and off and i don't know why but like um when before i was recording when we were just getting out the box and stuff um that whenever that light turned on that light turned off so that light turns on that light turns off that light turns off that light turns on and it was a really weird um thing i don't know why i did it but, okay. um, I don't know why I did it, but, um, off that topic, we're about to plug him in, and then I'm gonna make a time lapse of him, oh, there he is, okay, time's lap, action, go, ah, ah, oh god, okay, um, well, the good news is, I hope you like the time lapse, um, of him blowing up, it didn't take that long, it didn't take as long as I thought it would, but, be careful, Mom. Don't hurt him. Don't hurt him. Look at those creepy eyes. And we had a picture with my brother. He's tall. 
he's tall enough to reach his hand, and his head was like, his hand was like on his head, and it was creepy. Well, he, ah, I stepped on a rock. Nope, manly feet. Um. Now we kind of have those trees. Yeah, we do. Well, we should have blew him up uh, out here, because now he's over there, and people on, hold on, we're testing this out. I'm gonna see if people on the sidewalk can see. Yeah, because then kids are like, and then they're like, ah! Ah! so that's that's reaction. That's what I would react like. The first time I saw this guy, I was like, "Mom, we need to buy this. This is going in our yard." Yeah, I, that was pretty fast. I didn't think he would blow up that fast, but I guess I guess he did. Mom, we found a nail. Nail. Poke. Um, Mom, where should I put this nail? I need it. Okay. So hold on to it. Okay, I'm holding on to it. We're just gonna get him stapled into the ground. Nothing really important. And then, Mom, are we gonna move on to Boo after that? Yeah, Boo's in the house. Though. Okay. Um, so we're just gonna nail things in. And then... We're gonna get our other thing out, Boo. He's um, a ghost, obviously. And he's got a little sign, he says Boo. He's, he's really cool. I'll get back to you guys when he gets blown up and we got Boo out, so, see ya. All right, guys, now we're on a, ow, what the frick, okay. Um, now we're on a mission to find um, our other Boo. Uh, I'm gonna type in the password. Don't want you guys to see him. Um, hi, Daisy, that's my doggy. Her name's Daisy, and that's, oh my god, he had crazy eyes. Holy, what the frick? Bo, no, stop it. Oh, stop it. Um, so, yeah, uh, let's open this up. See, um, this is all our home. Oh, while I'm on it, I should probably show you all of my Halloween direction, direction, de decorations inside. So that's me, when I was a bit younger. It's a picture of me. Oh, I'll start over here. So this is my sister, Mackenzie. She's got stars on her eyes and says, Strick, trick. Um, this is my brother, Zach, when we were younger. So um, that's bloody eye and bloody neck and he's or. And this is me, um, bloody eye, bloody nose, and treat. And then we have our window decorations over here. Um, we got a witch, we got bats, and we got bats and bats and bats. And then over here, um, we have our Happy Halloween, uh, I'm sorry for the light, we have Happy Halloween, um, there we go, and we have a blood splatter there, and then, if you look right here, we have this, and we have welcome and that stuff, and we have all our pictures and stuff, and then we have that, and that's pretty much, and we have our witch over here, which I don't think is on. Where? She's gonna turn on and scare the crap out of me. I don't think she's on right now, but I might get a video of her um, turning on, but I'm not sure. So let's get back to looking for Boo. Um, my thought someone's at the door. I thought my mom was knocking on the door. Um, I don't know. Oh, it's probably he's probably in that one. Let me just close that up. That's good enough. Oh, um, he's probably in this one. Ow, my fingers. Um, yeah, up here's Boo. Um, there's Boo. Hey, that's what he that's what he looks like right now. Um What the heck? Okay, so I'm just gonna go back outside and Mom, I got Boo. So um I think I'm just gonna stop it right here. I'll get back when we start setting up Boo Rawr. Alright guys, I've been sitting here watching my videos and I didn't even notice my mom already got Boo up. So, it'd probably take like um, five seconds in in like actual speed just for him to get up because he's, he's pretty small, but he's he's cool. He's, he's... Do you have any other decorations? For outside? Yeah. Not really. We used to have that ghost that went across there. Woo! Hmm. Yeah, we had a ghost that was motion censored, and whenever like you or uh, sound right, 
Yeah. Whenever you'd like clap or something, it would just go. Um, but yeah, uh, Jack, what the? Turn back on, please. Tap, 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 please. Actually, I don't think we need it on because I got a flash. Oh, there we go. That's on now. But yeah, he was pretty cool. He was like, I think he was my favorite until Freddy came. Because we had, when, Mom, um, our original things were Boo, Freddy. Yeah, we had, um, yeah, Frankie's dead. Um, we had Boo, our little ghost thingy. Sorry it cut out, but what I was going to say is that, um, our original things were Frankenstein, the little boo ghost, and then that one ghost who went I want a Freddy's story. As, as I promised in the beginning of the video, I am back here sharing the story of Freddy with you guys. This is just the story of Freddy that I made up. Now, if I stop at parts, that's because... Sorry, I just hit the mic. Um, That's because this isn't exactly scripted or anything. So... I just hope you guys enjoy this. So, here's the story. All right. So, Freddy was a small boy in, in tiny little kid. He was a small goblin in the land of Grensland. Now, Grensland wasn't a very nice place for children. Um, he often found himself coming home with a bloody nose or something like that. And so one day, Freddy, um, he was he started to get bullied, and he got bullied so much that he just couldn't take it anymore. So what he did is he told his mom that he was running away, and he he just ran off. And so a couple days later, he came back and he said, "Mom, I can't do this anymore. I wanna, I can't live by myself like that anymore." So he came back. And he lived fine. He lived fine for the next few days until, once again, he found that same kid, that same bully who, who bullied him. And that bully just kept bullying him day after day after day. And he told his mom he wanted to leave again. But then he, she was like, no, you can't do that because you are my child. It's my responsibility to take care of you. But she wasn't the best mom. So, um, what Freddy did was when he got older, he was about 14 years old, and he was still getting bullied. So, one day, he was so frustrated with it, he was just like, I need to take action. I need to do something about this. And so, he finally went and found that bully, and he said, dude, you need to stop this. I can't handle this anymore. You need to stop. So the bully said, all right, um, but he didn't say it like, okay, I'll, I'll stop, fine. He said in a voice that said, he didn't say it, but it said, screw you, I ain't doing this. So, of course, Freddy kept getting bullied and bullied and bullied. So finally, Freddy was like, you know what, violence is the only way to stop this. Um, so what he did was, the reason Freddy's eyes are bloodshot is because he spent days after days and weeks after weeks just stalking this guy, just seeing his every move. He he didn't he didn't even close his eyes at midnight. He never ever closed his eyes. He just kept watching and watching. And so one day, the bully saw him, and what do you think the bully did? He thought. This guy's eyes is bloodshot. He was probably up all night watching me. So um, the bully called the cops, and Freddy was arrested. And so, and then Freddy, one day in jail, Freddy was with his best friend, who was also bullied and also had done something very similar to this. His friend was also a stalker, pretty much. And... His friend was like, dude, let's get out of here. I mean, that's what pretty much anyone would want to say in jail. And normally when people say that, it never happens. But that that's what happens with Freddy. Freddy made it out of jail. 
And he went back to that bully's house, and he found the sharpest, mo most painfulest, most painful thing he could ever find. And he went to that house, and he ended it all. And Freddy was found again, and the in in Greensland, the trial for murder was death. So Freddy was killed, and then one day on October 31st, he came back, he found his best friend, and he killed him. He killed them all. And that's, 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 that's back, that's a horrible ending. I'm going to keep going this. Um, so, Freddy killed them all, and no mercy. There was no one left in Greensland except the bully's parents and all the bully's friends. And he said, I am going to kill you in the most painful way ever. And that's the story of Freddy. I hope you guys enjoyed. Yeah, and then Freddy went back to underground. So, um, that was kind of a stupid story. Um, may, hopefully you guys liked it, but I got nothing else to say. Um, for now, peace out, Halloween Biscuits. Bye!